Take a look, it's 1962 Ford Thunderbird hardtop, commonly nicknamed Bullet Nose Birds. This particular one is nicknamed Tiki Bird, and I'll kind of show you some of the things as we go around this car that make it stand out. Very nice looking show car. First of all, underneath the hood, 394 barrel. That is the way this car would have came from Ford back in 1962. That is paired with a Cruise-O-Matic automatic transmission. Color of this car, chestnut and Corinthian white, which is also the way it would have came from Ford. Paint codes VM designate that on the data tag, and you can check out the data tag and still pictures of this car. I'll get to that in a minute where you can see all of those. As far as the condition of this paint, nice shape, like I said close to a show quality paint. Um, there's a few little touch-ups that you'll have, but been done with a very nice matching paint. You can see the pinstriping on here, done by Relic, which is in our area, well-known pinstriper. It's been around for a while now. Does very, very nice work. There's also some lace paint, some metallic on the roof of this car we'll get into also. Now, still pictures, so you check out that data tag. Check out the close-up pictures I have of the paint. Um, underside interior still pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com down below this video in the description there's a link click on it that's going to take you right there of course you can call us to be happy to discuss this car with you 507-386-1726 um, restoration on this vehicle was done approximately 10 years ago and uh, car has less than 10,000 miles on it since it was restored uh, underneath the hood, along with that 390, we got power steering, power brakes, AC, AC does blow cold. Compressor turns on and off. And uh, we'll fire this up. I'll show you the engine bay as uh, we get around to the other side. You can see this car is nice and straight. Riding on Firestone white wall radials, chrome wheel covers, the fender skirts back here. Interior is a 59 trim code which was chestnut so we still have a chestnut interior in here center console shifter on the column of course with the slide away steering column wanted to show you something take a look at this if you can see it from here it is a surfboard for a rear view mirror one of the tiki bird motifs on there you can see that Pretty cool. Now, as far as some of the custom paint up here, if I can get it to show up, we have some metallic, we have some lace work done. Um, there's actually lace roses if that is showing up and you can see it. And again, all this can be seen in our still pictures also. So pretty darn cool. Thunderbird here. And remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist you with getting this card where you're located at. It may be eligible for an extended service contract. Something else very neat about this car, Bellflower pipes. Take a look at that. There is also a Pierce Brothers dealership placard or license plate frame that goes with this. And that was out of Bellflower, California. So kind of a cool little treat that goes with it along with the bellflower pipes on it. Some more of the pinstriping by Relic back here. Pinstriping was done in 2015. Another Tiki Berg motif right back here. And as you can see, the chrome and the bright work, also very nice in this car. Great sound to it. And uh, good looking car. Let's see, anything else that I'm missing along the way on this one? I think I've kind of hit on everything. And again, if you have any questions, I'll give you that phone number again here in a bit. Feel free to call or email. Uh, seat belts have been installed, as you can see. Power windows, door panels, little Tiki Bird motif on the steering wheel also. And you can see some of these little kind of aqua jewel inlays on any of the little points there on the dash. Just some neat little stuff that sets this car apart. Interior also very nice. All right, let's go ahead and fire this up. All right, 
see how easily it starts. Check out pretty much stock dash. Dash is a nice shape. Again, the folks that brought this here, they drive it. They drove it 100 miles approximately to get here. Like I said, uh, 10,000 or less miles on it since the restoration. Power steering, power brakes, AC. Very nice interior in this car also. Headliner in great shape. Let's take a look at that. Also good. All right. Flip around to the back and hear these bellflower pipes. How's that for a sound? All right, let's check out this engine bay. Check out that 390 underneath there. Let's see how that looks. All right, so we got the engine popped. Check out the underside of the hood, nice and tidy. And the engine bay, of course, there's the 390 four barrel. What this car would have been born with from Ford Motor Company. Remember, power steering, power brakes, AC, AC does low coal. And this car was brought to us to sell. It was driven 100 miles, so they got in it and drove it. Smooth running. And as you notice, it has been converted to, as far as the AC goes, has been converted from the old R12. But yeah, very nice and tidy engine bay. There you go, if you're looking for a nice 1962 custom Thunderbird hardtop. Great look to it, original colors. Here it is. Give us a call, 507-386-1726. UniqueClassicCars.com. Down below this video in the description, there's a link. Click on it, that's going to take you right there. Remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist you in getting this car to where you're located at, and it may be eligible for an extended service contract consult with your sales associate when you call in or email.